So we are seeing that data tells us a big story about who is underserved. And then when we are able to figure out who is underserved, then we as advocates in the community, whether that's nonprofits like Ocapica, um, or even community members who are willing to share their stories with legislators, we can use our voice to show those discrepancies. So when we can say more Southeast Asians are targeted, but we also see that in our work, because we do homelessness prevention, we do mental health service, that there's also a high number of Southeast Asians in poverty levels, then we can make correlations saying, hey, we can reduce hate crimes, government, you need to support housing programs, you need to support um, social service programs, so that these people are not in conditions, um, working low wages or getting exploited um, in their workplaces, taking verbal harassment when they don't need to because they need that paycheck. We can say instead, if you're able to support higher wages, if you're able to support um, stronger government assistance programs, then we can reduce the conditions where people will be a victim of hate crime or hate incident. Um, and so 